The opioid epidemic continues to affect families and communities all over the country, including here in Eastern Carolina. News 12's Maya Cruz tells us how town leaders like in Emerald Isle are working to fight this issue. The town of Emerald Isle is a vacation destination, but it is not immune to the opioid epidemic. Last year, there were 24 overdoses in Emerald Isle, two of those resulting in death. That's according to Carteret County Sheriff Asa Buck. Even though those numbers are down from previous years, there is still work to do. Even though it's a, a slight decline from years previous, it, it's, not the number, it's not the decline we would like to see. It's not a major uh, uh, decline in those numbers, the overdose numbers. Um. This morning in Emerald Isle, Carteret County Sheriff Asa Buck spoke to members of the community about how his office is fighting the drug epidemic and what they can do. Emerald Isle's assistant police chief says his team is planning to increase neighborhood watch programs around the island to help cut down on drug-related issues. During tourist season, we obviously go from a town of about 4,000 to a town of close to 50,000. So yes, with that, the crime rate increases a bit. However, we do uh, increase our staffing levels during those months to combat that. Edwards says due to the changing and growing drug epidemic, their officers will be attending updated training to combat this issue. As for Sheriff Buck's deputies, he says they are all equipped with Narcon to help revive overdose victims. Maya Cruz, News 12.